ുംസ്മാൻ Guzman, a former philosophy professor, launched an insurgency against the state in 1980 and proceeded over numerous car bombings and assassinations in the year that followed. The first fully robotic lunar sample retained at about the same time the Apollo 11 astronauts were completing their historic first human moon walk. Luna 15, a robotic space mission of the Soviet space program, began its descent to the surface of the moon from lunar orbit. tasked with the objective of gathering lunar samples and returning them to earth luna 15 crashed on the lunar surface and was destroyed on impact luna 15 was one among a string of failures in the soviet space program in its attempt to bring lunar samples back to earth they eventually succeeded with the luna 16 which became the first mission to retrieve samples from the moon's surface without direct human involvement unity the central lesson from september 11 attacks said US president on the 20th anniversary of September 11 terror attacks US president Joe Biden called for unity in America saying it was the central lesson for September 11 Mr Biden released a pre-recorded video message on September 10 from the White House in which he paid tribute to the 2977 people from 90 counties who were killed in New York City Arlington Shanksville 20 years ago The president spent the day visiting commemorative events at the sites of the attacks. Let's move on to the national news. Trend of government agencies harassing independent media must stop. Editors guide. The Editors Guide of India that is EGI on Saturday expressed the concern over income tax department officials seizing journalists data from the offices of news website News Laundry on Friday. In a statement, the EGI said it was disturbed by what they called surveys by the IT officials. News Laundry co-founder Abhinandan Shekri however said in a statement, the visit was an attack on press freedom. Liberal education can inculcate curiosity and the ability to learn. Say experts in Indian higher education should develop students with an ability to be curious, question everything, be articulate and able to solve problems proactively. Let's move on to the state news. Museum Sri Chitra Gallery in Tiruvannamalai to reopen on September 14. After nearly 4 and a half months, the Department of Museum and Zoos has decided to reopen the Napier Museum, Natural History Museum, Sri Chitra Art Gallery and the Botanical Garden on the Zoo and the Museum campus in Tiruvannamalai. To the public on Tuesday in adherence to COVID-19 protocols, the City Zoo and the Children's Park will not open for first time. Although the COVID-19 case graph in the state has come down a bit in the interest of animal safety, authorities will monitor the situation for two more months before taking a decision on reopening the zoo, most likely at the beginning of October. Kerala conducts house-to-house survey in three kilometer radius of Yupa containment zone. The Kerala government has conducted a complete house-to-house survey within three kilometer radius from the house of. the 12 year old boy who succumbed to nipah virus on september 5 as part of his cover surveillance chief minister pinarayi vijayan said on september 10 a house to house survey was conducted within a 3 km radius from the house of that this is the child the survey was held in around 15000 houses and involved around 68000 persons the surveillance team sought details of any unusual fever or unnatural death in the these areas Mr Vijayan said adding that no such cases were reported in this survey I was really nervous 
says Ronaldo after second debut at Manchester United. Cristiano Ronaldo has scored nearly 800 goals for club and country and won numerous trophies in a 19-year career. But the Portuguese forward admitted having butterflies in his stomach ahead of his second debut at Manchester United on Saturday. Ronaldo, who scored 180 goals for United during his first stint, nettled twice on his return in a 4-1 win over Newcastle United at Old Trafford that sent the Manchester club to the top of the Premier League standings. Let's move to the school news. Today, we celebrate the Grandparents Day. We must respect the old people, they are always guide us in all aspects. So let us remember our grandparents with great respect and love. Let me recite this Malayalam lines. Sir Jagadish Chandra Bose Jagadish Chandra Bose was a biologist, physicist, botanist and an early writer of science fiction. He pioneered the investigation of radio and microwave optics, made significant contribution to plant science and laid the foundation of experimental science in the Indian subcontinent. He invented the chrysograph, a device for measuring the growth of plants. Bose was an excellent teacher, extensively using scientific demonstrations in class. Some of his students, such as Asian Bose, went on to become famous physicists themselves. During this period, Bose also started doing original scientific work in the area of microwaves, carrying out experiments involving refraction, diffraction and polarization. He developed the use of Galena crystals for making receivers both for short wavelength radio waves and for white and ultraviolet light. In 1895, two years before Marconi's demonstration, both demonstration wireless communication using radio waves, using them to ring a bell remotely to explode some gunpowder. Both then turned his attention to respond phenomena in plants. He showed that not only animals but vegetative tissues produce similar electrical response under different kind of stimuli mechanical thermal electrical and chemical let's watch the performance of our child prodigies <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 